In November, new research reveals that replacing 30% of meat with plant proteins could offset almost all global aviation emissions, free up an India-sized carbon sink, and save 7.5 swimming pools worth of water a year. An animal right activist is convicted of a felony for rescuing sick chickens, marking the first time a direct action everywhere open rescue case has ended with an activist incarceration. In California, cell-based meat company Omeek completes construction of its pilot plant, which has the capacity to produce up to 400 tons of product. A new study on the consumption of ultra-processed foods and risk of multi-morbidity of cancer and cardiometabolic diseases finds that associations were most notable for animal-based products, while plant-based alternatives were not associated with the risk. Cigarette-style climate warnings on food could cut meat consumption, a new study suggests, which could reduce selections of meals containing meat by 7 to 10 percent. A new report details how the livestock industry's new methane metric called GWP Star would normalize high methane emissions by setting the baseline to current levels. Italy bans cultivated meat and the use of meat-related names such as salami or steak for plant-based products. And AI predicts the majority of the world will be vegan by 2075, thanks to Gen Z and millennials.